domestic violence is on the rise. Someone is charged with partner or family member assault almost every day in Gallatin County. Our Cassidy Powers visited Haven, the local nonprofit that helps domestic violence survivors find out why the numbers are so high. Domestic violence happens more often around the Gallatin Valley than you may think. In fact, in just the last year, one local nonprofit that supports survivors of domestic violence has seen an 87% increase in overnight stays. It's a massive issue, much bigger than many of us realize. For over a decade, Erica Eights Coyle has helped survivors of domestic violence here in the Gallatin Valley. As the executive director of Haven, she's worked firsthand with every one of the 1,200 survivors that come through Haven's program every year. That number can be a big surprise for a lot of members of our community. And just thinking about 1,200 people, that's like the population of West Yellowstone, the entire population experiencing domestic violence. According to Break the Cycle, a domestic violence statistic tracker, every minute, 32 people experience domestic violence in the United States. And those numbers are reflected right here in Gallatin County. Last year, with a budget of $8.6 million, Haven opened their new facility with 30 bedrooms for domestic violence survivors. Today, those 30 rooms are almost at capacity, and Erica says will likely be full by the end of the year. Since the facility's opening, Haven has seen an 87% increase in overnight stays. But that's not the only thing on the rise. They've also seen an 8% increase in the number of phone calls they receive to their 24-hour support line. So why are we seeing such an uptick? The Galton County is growing by quite a bit. And so inevitably, we're going to see increased needs on all of our nonprofits. But Detective Captain Dana McNeil with Bozeman Police tells me domestic violence rates seem to be growing even faster than the population. We see an increase of about 10% every year in domestic violence. You know, we have a population growth in our city of about five, six percent, somewhere in there. We would say that probably our domestic violence rates are outpacing the growth. So is there a way to stop the incline? Haven has a number of prevention programs, working with youth as well as the general public to get upstream of this issue. Our focus is really on how do we keep people from becoming abusive? Because really the responsibility is on the person causing the abuse. If you're in a domestic violence situation or you're not sure but want to seek help, Haven's 24-hour phone line is open to anyone. Just call 406-586-4111. I have the immense privilege of getting to see the very real impact that Haven has every day on our community. That's something that's very meaningful and gives me a lot of hope. In Bozeman, Cassidy Powers, MTN News.